but I roll with patience. The race set before me. Every one of us have been anointed. Every one of us have received the gift of God. Sustain it. Did you understand? Sustain it. Don't look to another. Understand your own. Many are too busy looking at what is working. Oh, this is the rainy thing now. Let me do it. It is the rainy thing because somebody focused and maintained and walked and toned his own. What are you doing about your own? Do your own. Very soon you become the rainy thing. Until you attain it, don't be distracted. Are you getting me? Don't be distracted. I usually tell myself one thing. My grandmom used to say it. It's not how far, it's how well. The more I grow, the more that word has become a path for me. Oh, we just did this. Praise God for you. We just bought the land. Praise God for you. Pastor Matthew, when are you getting the land? I said, when we're ready. Huh? Everybody in the stadium are getting lands. It's not my business. I'm not everybody. That's why if you're talking to me, if you're just with me and we're playing, and I say, ah, you don't care, you don't love me, and I say, ah, pass everybody saying, you see me react so quickly. I'm not everybody. I don't like that language one bit because I don't think like everybody. I don't accept the thought of everybody. I don't act like everybody. I am Martins of the Most High. It's in my veins. Come on, shout, I'm charting my course. Maintain focus. Listen to this. The greatest of monuments took the longest of time to erect. Are you seeing here? Take time. You want to sustain the anointing. Another thing is you must build on the grace. You must build on the grace. What do I mean? You will run out very soon if you are still in one place. You must build on the grace. In other words, you must grow spiritually. That's what I'm talking about. You must grow in truth. You must grow in your prayer life. You must grow in your worship life. Then you must educate your spirit and your mind. You must be on an ever increasing path of growth. If you hear, say amen. Why? Grace multiplies as you increase in knowledge. 